Hi guys, Nyan here from Press Start TV, and we are here with Steve, the general manager for Versus Evil, and we've got two awesome games we want to talk about today, Banner Saga 2 and Afro Samurai 2. Can you, what can you tell me a little bit about Banner Saga 2? Does it pick up from where the first one kind of left off, yes, or does it kind of go in a new direction? Yes, the Banner Saga 2, uh, what's important for everybody to know that's fans of Banner Saga 1 is finish the game. Finish the game. So because it's, the it's, choices it's, that you, you make, yes. well, you don't have to. And, I mean, it's just we're... But yeah, if there, you want a gonna, deeper, richer story, you yes, want that, that you want connection it to be between the first story. one and the second one. Absolutely. So the choices that you make uh, absolutely affect and carry over into the second game. So we want Excellent. we want to make sure that you play and finish the first game. Uh, I think it's still on sale on Steam right now. But if it's it might that have read yeah, over right now. Summer Steam summer sale. Yeah, that's right. But um, so what they've done is they they've done a really good job of listening to the fans right and some of the press and getting the, some of the Making constructive the feedback. Changes that they yeah, were so for and they they really improved uh, combat. You know, Good. people are looking for variety in terms of the, in terms of different types of people you're fighting, creatures and things like that as well, different wind conditions. Right. Uh, so they really took that to heart. They added a lot more production value to the cinematics. You'll see stories being told through battle now as well. Excellent. All cool. of that's playable here, so you can see all that stuff. Yeah, we'll definitely check that out. Yeah, and um, so those are the things that are really kind of just kind of carrying through. And, of course, it's still this bleak story, and it's right. really rough. Right. really rich, really deep, nice yes. character involvement. And your choices affect the outcomes and all that yes, kind of stuff. Yes, and you, you know, um, they've done a, a great job of even making, you know, the management of the clan be very important right. as well, and that, and that that has an impact. So, uh, they've made a, a deeper, what richer was game. originally there, yes, pretty much. absolutely. Great, great, great. And now, Afro Samurai 2. Yes. Is it because of the new series that's coming out as well, or is it because of just you guys wanted to make Afro Samurai 2? You know, um, yeah, I can't speak to the other stuff. The The... The team was the right. original creators of the, of the game. Which I love, by the way. I love the first game. Thank you. Great, great uh, game. They did, a, they did a great job. They're very passionate about right. this game. And they basically came to me and they said, um, we need your help to get it done. Right. And um, at first I didn't consider it because, you know, we're an indie publisher. It's usually, you know, your IPs, we help you get your right. stuff to market. Right. But they're like, no, but this is the game that we want to make. Right. I'm like, well, then let's do that. So I worked with them and, and we got in touch with Gonzo, we, we worked on the license, we got all everything going and and it was because they were passionate about it. This was the game they wanted to make, so they're like, yeah, let's rock. Now is it is it the same kind of combat and story development with the first one or is it a whole new they've, direction? They that focus they've gone a with lot more with, with story. Uh, Jim DeFelice is the author of American Sniper, right. so he's he's writing. Um, and That's they really, really wanted to, they wanted to make um, the story, I mean, it's a really pretty rough story. I mean, oh, yeah. Afro I love the Afro. I love the, I love the anime when it was out, and I can't yes. wait for the next series to start. Yes. It's dark, it's gritty, I yes. love it. So yeah. there's some deep, rich story parts. We've added even some more adventure aspects to it as well. Cool, cool. Uh, mainly so that it's not always just button mashing, you know, combat, things like right. that. Uh, but then the combat's changed. We've made it a little bit more accessible. But what we've done, we've, we've extended the depth of it. So you have multiple fighting styles that you can do. Gotcha. You've got, Instead of just like smashing the same button over and over again and achieving the same results. Right. Well, we've what we've got is is just different different fighting styles. So we've got Afro, which is much more controlled, acrobatic. He's flipping over right. guys. He's much got great defensive moves. Kuma, it's just cutting people in half. And then you've got awesome. Master Style, which is if you see him go and he'll clear. I mean, you should play it because he'll clear a whole we'll room. Definitely check it out. You know, it's almost like everybody's head's exploding. It's 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 awesome. But so you've got all these different styles which you can grow and improve. Right. Uh, and that's where we've kind of added the depth from a combat perspective. Awesome. But we've removed some of the things where like, you know, you're kind of slicing off a nose, like the very specific right. slicing stuff. Uh, just because um, we wanted to really kind of focus on, it's an it's a episodic game. Right. So we're going to be rolling out volume one and then in quick successions, volume two and Seems three. Seems to be a popular trend right now and yeah. it's doing very, very well. Yeah, so we're making the price point to be there very mass market okay. friendly then as well uh, on Xbox One, PlayStation 4, and PC. Yeah, so um, we just want to kind of continue to tell that, that Afro story. Keep that story going. And this time you're playing as Kuma. So Awesome. Now, one last question important to Afro Samurai. Is Samuel Jackson involved in any way? Uh, we are not talking about that right now, oh, but we will come, come out with, we, we will let people know. Um, that, that's key, what we, man. What we can say definitively is uh, obviously the RZA. Right. Is involved. The music and everything is fantastic. We've awesome. got some great guys, uh, young guys um, that are producing the music, and it's awesome. Cool. We're going to be has an awesome soundtrack. It, it does, and it's, this one is no different. Um, so, uh, more news on that. That's going to be coming out soon. Coming actually, this year. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Excellent, excellent, excellent. So we got Banner Saga Two is on PC. PC. No release date yet. No release. Winter. Winter. 2015. It's going to be cold. It's going to be cold. It's winter. He's he's good at dodging. It's this winter. guy. <laughs> 
And then <laughs> Afro Samurai 2 is PC, PS4, and Xbox One. Yes, sir. Same kind of scenario, winner, or just... No, uh, we'll be no making an announcement very soon. Excellent. Uh, okay, we'll be great. making an announcement soon on that one. We'll have all the news and information for that. Stay here at Press Start TV.